That guy was also purposely bug abusing. He griefed me and is bug abusing. If you use a certain boom, you can glitch other players out of the game. So he purposely switched to it so that he can try to like make other people like disconnect. They basically published the bug and they're like, yeah, don't use it. And then he's like, oh, I'm gonna use it and try to make other people disconnect. One, two, three, four, five, six. Pretty sure Pantheon's a really bad build now. Oh, oh Tome Master. Pretty sure Pantheon's bad right now. If I slam a shiv, I'll probably win streak if I slam a shiv. But if I want to build best in slot Yone with dualist dexterity, I need this bow for something else. Oh, uh, going on a win streak here is actually probably not in my interest. Unless I'm down to play Deja. If I'm down to play Deja, it's totally fine. Malleus, motherfucker. Uh, I'll be right back. Any Yones? Oh, a Nunu? Hmm. Okay, interesting. If I have to slam a shiv, I think I will. Hello, Sumo Gandhi. I feel like rerolling Yone is like really iffy. Shiv is fine. Okay, I beat this guy for sure though. What's better for Duelist Yone, RFC or Rage Blade? Uh, Rage Blade is definitely better if you have a QSS or something. But if I had to choose, I would take an RFC because it. Not only is it just good for damage, it also just gives you a lot of safety. Wait, I actually think I lose this. I think I need to slam the ship to win. Wait a second. Oh no, if only I slammed the shiv a tiny bit sooner. Oh, that's so sad. I thought I win, so I, did, I didn't slam it. Wow, what a blunder. If I slammed it like five autos sooner, I would have won. I actually got owned. All right, I'm down to not go for real, Yone. 
I think if you want to play like a reroll comp like that, you gotta hit like... You gotta hit a lot of Yone's early. You gotta hit like three to then say, I'm gonna force Yone. Let's instead just go for uh, Deja. I can't believe I lost that. Actually, maybe it doesn't matter. I was gonna lose this one too. The fast lobster is not fast enough. Oh, this guy destroyed me. I didn't kill a single unit. No, Yone. Deja is my new best friend. Yone, we're breaking up. You took too long to come. Pause the playlist. This is too intense. Give me something a little bit more chill. Something like... Yeah. Man, I really thought this lobster was gonna be Pog. Pogster. Pobster. Oh, pain assault. Welcome. Recon. So much fun. Give me a Yone. Just one. Please. Ah, I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it, guys. Smadge. Oh, wait, that's Madge too. Oh my God, I didn't mean to say such a such an angry word. I meant to say Smadge. All right, question. Am I rolling next round? I think I'm rolling. I'm rolling for one Yone. If I randomly hit a Deja, we pog. I've locked in the Mirage Spat, so we're basically like forced to play it, but it's fine. I really only need one Deja to stabilize. Actually, I only need one Deja to pop off. I wonder if Pantheon's still good. I feel like he's not. Mirage Heart gain a Yone? Oh my god. It's time! Must be done. It's actually time. I bring death. Wait, this is so exciting. I should have Deja, and that's eight Mirage. Wait, that's so crazy! I'm already getting to eight. I'm pretty sure you don't actually want Archangels here. Archangels is normally good, but this is supposed to be like a fast comp. It's basically like Challengers from uh, set six. So we just go fast. So bursty, bursty, bursty. Uh, like JGIE or something, or uh, Rabidons. Wait, someone said Shisha Deja already? No! Who has a Deja? Damn it. It's time to eat him. I'm gonna eat him raw. When going gets tough, you call draw. Yeah, I'm just gonna give it all to Olaf. By steel. Olaf should be able to kill a few units here. Dude, imagine scoped weapons here. Holy shit. If I got scoped weapons three. Oh, Yone 2 would probably get me first place.
Please kill this one HP at least in. Oh my god. This guy is contesting me, smash. Me no pivot. Where's my glove? Oh, what the heck, it just spawned. Actually, these skills is pretty good here anyway. All right, hopefully this Olaf pops off. All right, I actually need one Deja. Go to seven, roll for one Deja. This is a Jace two at six. How do you have a Jace two at six? Hello? Am I missing something? How do you have Jace 2 at 6? I don't think I killed a single unit. How do you have a Jace 2 at 6? I really need just, dude, just one Deja and this game transforms. One Deja. Man, am I really that weak? Oh my god, this Deja is just gonna fuck everybody. Damn high rollers. That Deja is actually just gonna destroy everything. IE with Jeweled Lotus, and then Hat and Gunblade, and Dual Dexterity. Oh god, I'm facing him. He's gonna wipe my whole board in like three seconds. He's got six Mirage. I'm so jealous. Please at least kill a few units. Thank you. All right, I'm gonna send it to seven and I'm going to roll until I hit one Deja. This could take anywhere from like one roll to like 50 rolls. I think the average amount of rolls needed here is like seven. If I can get this Deja in seven rolls, I'll be happy. Yeah, if I get this Deja in seven rolls, I'm happy. Also, you might randomly hit a Nunu. Or Hecarim. Spat? Oh, Nico. Let's show our friends. Come on. Actually, I hit like almost everything. Maybe I actually just chill, go eight. No prison can hold me. Yeah, I'm gonna go eight. <laughs> Two star Deja? You've gotta be kidding me, man. Why? It's too contested. This guy's not even playing Deja. He's just like randomly throwing one in. Okay, literally, I just need a one star. Like, just for the synergy. I'm gonna go eight. I'm just gonna roll for one Deja. That's it. And then I'm stable. Okay, I know I don't have much gold, but surely we can hit one. No prison hold. I hit every dragon besides Deja. No, I hit every dragon besides Deja, dude. I hit everything besides Deja. Okay, literally, I think I have to play this. I have to play this Yone as if it were uh, Deja. I think otherwise I'm just gonna lose.
Please. I understand that it's contested. There's probably like four out right now. Just let me hit one. I'm not asking for a lot. Just let me have one. One. And this game is free. No. Please. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. The game is playable now. Next time, next Yone I get, I'll remake. I hit one Deja, sheesh. We're high rolling. All right, this Yone too will be fine for now. Like, I mostly just need Deja for the eight Mirage. Oh, maybe I get Yasuo on Carousel. Oh yes, surround the Zaya. This guy went Zaya and he got a Shivana at seven. Yasuo on Carousel? No. These gloves should be pretty efficient here. You just slam it on Nunu, call it a day. With so much attack speed, it should be pretty decent. Also, this Yone is not bad. I'm pretty sure that, yeah, he's my top frag. Oh my God, wait. Wait, what a roll. What a roll. What's the Mirage? It's go fast. Go zoom zoom. Check us out. He accelerates. This data just melts the whole board. And this Olaf's not bad. His items are super scuffed, but whatever. Would you ever remake Olaf to move the Shiv to Deja? No, Deja should- Oh! Deja shouldn't even have the Shiv. The Shiv should just be on like someone else. Uh, Deja should have like a Hodge or something. Hodge, BT, Gunblade, something like that. Thank God I hit this two-star Deja. I can actually play the game. And this Yasuo is super lucky. Uh, I'll eventually, I gotta find some units to replace this, this Olaf. Just more tanks. Tanks, 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 calves, tanks, 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 calves. Soraka Bard. Oh, nice. Box Box, help me. I can't stand this Dark Flight Cannoneer meta. You'll be happy to know that both of those traits were nerfed today. Gold Collector. What? Lagoon Emblem. Zanya's. Oh, I actually think that's really good. Yeah, I think that's really good. Also, it lets me stop rolling. Okay, I do remember that there was a bug where... There's a bug. I still remember. Where um, Deja can actually lose his ult if you get activated at the wrong time. But it's still a pretty good item. I think we just play it. I actually think this is better. And we can do Mirage, Bard, Wokech. No, actually, actually Wokech right here. But yeah, there is a bug where Deja loses his cast. I hope it doesn't happen to me, but it could happen. It could happen, and if it happens, I'm going to be very sad. It happens when uh, Zanyas gets activated, and then he ults. Surely that's not going to happen. Okay, it already happened. At least I still won. It already happened. If at any point during the 2.5 second invulnerability he casts, it just goes away. I mean, on the bright side, at least it's dualist dexterity Deja where he doesn't really need his cast. I've lost like, like a Dawnbringer 200 AP Deja cast before and it makes me really mad. Would I ever be so petty as to hold this Deja just so other players can't get him? That guy already hit his two star. That guy... 
No, it's not even worth. Even if I wanted to, it's like it's just bad. I need to go nine. Yeah, Nunu came here to fuck bitches. Hello, Cuevo. Oh, this stage is so satisfying. Oh, nice. And we avoided the Lux. All right, scale up real fast. RFC is actually better than Gwinsu's here, so I'm really happy. This is very lucky itemization. Oh my god. This guy actually just destroys everything. 30% attack speed per attack, up to 10 stacks, so 300% attack speed. Why is RFC better than Gwinsu's? Uh, for Deja, it's because Deja has a very slow windup. Deja has a very slow base attack speed, so Gwinsu's takes a long time to ramp up on him. So RFC just kind of gets you to like a pretty acceptable state from the beginning. So like if you look at like the damage curve of Deja, well if you look at like Zaya with Gwinsu, she needs Gwinsu. She has high basic attack speed, uh, and she like goes super fast eventually. But Deja just never reaches that point before the fight's over. Uh, for De for Ar Gwinsu's to be better on Deja, you need the fight to last like 20 some seconds. Do you want to play Terra over Braum? Uh, Terra 1's not worth it. I'm not even kidding, like, Braum 2 is, like, he's a 2 cost, but he's pretty good. But yeah, so, like, something to think about when you, when you think about Gwinsu's is, like, even though the end game is pretty pog, the end game for Deja, oh my god, that Yasuo, that's definitely going to get taken away. Even though the end game is pretty pog, like the RFC Deja kills a few units at the beginning of the fight, making the enemy team weaker. Okay, I actually think it's Hodge. Sorry, not Hodge, whatever this is. I'm gonna actually give this to Yasuo. I could give it to Bard, but I'm really stubborn. I don't want to admit I made a mistake slamming this bow, so I will simply slam it on Yasuo. Hello, Ghost Arcanine. Thanks for two months. Oh, you poor soul. I I too have played Shuyu once in my life, and I was very disappointed. It is time for you to understand that this unit is garbage. Even at two star, even with a perfect board. His board does look very good, I'll give you that. But watch as it pales in comparison to a simple Deja board. Zanyo! Wow, I, I really just hit this board and then I just never lost again. This Mirage bar just kind of go, goes kind of hard. No, I'm not- I'm not kidding. This Mirage Bard goes hard. He gets like three ults per round. Could have gone for Deja 3. No, someone's still alive with Dejas. Oh wait, this guy might beat me. His Deja items might be better than mine. He's got IEJG. Okay, wait, this could be- and I'm not kidding. This could be a Zanya's gap. Could be a Zanya's gap. Hey, <laughs> get Zanyad. <laughs> God, what a what a funny item. His Dacia is better than mine, but I have Zanyas. The cheese. Ooh, ooh, a giant slayer. Wait, the Zanyas is so funny. This is so broken, and it gives you. 50 AP, 40 armor, 40 magic assist, and then invulnerability. Wait, Zanyas is nuts! I mean, besides the bug where it cancels your ult. That's actually a crazy item. Alright, I just level up and I play... I need Rakan. Rakan. For... Oh. Okay, um... I don't even think I need to roll. I think I only roll once I start losing. Oh wait, there's a lot of AP.
Hello, dark chocolate. Welcome. Uh-oh, wait, this Aushin might own me. Okay, it's fine, because Zonya's. Yeah, we're fine. Oh my god, Nunu just ate his ass. Isn't Braum kind of useless here? Uh... I mean, he's three guarded, but like, just because he doesn't hit the synergy doesn't mean he's useless. He's a two-star frontline, right? Deja will kill everything in the game, right? Deja will kill everything. All that matters is having frontline, so just randomly having a two-star Braum is nice. Sejuani just giving Cavalier and 100 HP to my team is nice. It's literally just a game of frontline, backline. Uh, once I do roll, what am I going to look for? Uh, Yasuo 2, Rakan 2, Cell Braum, Cell Sejuani, Hecarim 2, Bard 2, Soraka 2. Okay. Easy. Okay, this time I wanted my Deja to face his Lux. Because I think my Deja wins. They're going to like 69 each other. And I'm pretty sure Deja wins this. Oh, yeah, yeah. He'll kill her in two, two strokes. Oh, my God. I see why Deja is so popular. This is really broken. Dies of kick. Yeah. I definitely understand why Deja is so hotly contested. This is just ridiculous. We're approaching the end of the game, so I'm down to start rolling. Huge Yasuo too. My team is so tanky, and Deja kills everything in seconds. You know, honestly, I'm very impressed that this guy top forward with Shioyu. Every time I try Shioyu, he's garbage! I hit Shioyu too super early with good items, and he does nothing. So the fact that this guy managed to make it kind of work is kind of crazy. Uh, Guardian side would have been good if I kept that Braum. I'm down to give this rock a pair for this. There's a reasonable chance. Actually, I think I think these guys are just both dead. I might get a double kill here. This board's crazy. What? What are the odds I get a triple Deja shop? Oh. I'm probably gonna kill him here. Alright, I don't wanna int the round, but I'm down to see if you can beat me. Down to just like sit here and see if he can win. I feel like the Deja is just way too unstoppable. I think the problem with Shioyu is that he just requires. He can't hit the back line, so he actually has to like muscle through the front line. He has to muscle through the front line before you can really play the game. And it just takes too long. He used to be so good, I wonder what happened. He used to be good in set 7.
Wait, you see this? My Deja just gets to attack for free forever. Shoot, you got old. That's so sad. I think it's that cutscene. Oh yeah, Nico and Navy were pretty good units. Pog, I was your Pog. Okay, I mean, that was good. I was pretty smashed from earlier, so we'll take this. The itemization worked out really well. Playing Yone as a carry while we waited for Deja was actually kind of crazy. And then I think once we got the Deja 1, we kind of locked in top four. Pretty sure like if I played that entire game with a Deja 1, it would have been okay. I would have lost a few fights, but I would have still probably made it to nine. Uh, Naturaling the second Deja and then Nikoing it was like instant first place. I felt like it was impossible to lose from that spot. And then we got a fucking Yasuo in the next shop. That's crazy.